Next is preparation method of haloalkanes. So the first preparation method which we will be going to study is from alcohols. So let's see what is happening in this case if we write the general reaction. So if we take alcohol and react with halogen acid, there will be formation of Rx haloalkanes and removal of H2O. Order of reactivity of halogen acid is given as more reactive halogen acid is HI, then HBr, then HCl. So this is the order of reactivity of halogen acid. So what is happening in this case? How this reaction is taking place? This reaction is taking place by the help of carbocation formation. It means in this the mechanism is involving formation of carbocation. So let's see how the mechanism is playing in this case. In this case, we know that in ROH that is alcohol there is lone pair is present in the oxygen so in the presence of halogen acid what is happening in this case there is ionization of halogen acid will be taking place it means this HX bond will ionize to form H plus and X minus so first of all this electrophile that is H plus will react with this alcohol because in the case of alcohol there are two lone pairs so there is a formation of protonated alcohol will take place so there is formation of this protonated alcohol further because a positive charge in oxygen is less stable so this bond will shift it towards oxygen so there is formation of carbocation this nucleophile will attack so when nucleophile will attack there will be formation of alkyl halide will takes place in this step there will be removal of h2o so this is the mechanism so it means in this case the reactive intermediate is carbocation and we know the stability order of carbocation is 3 degree is most stable then 2 degree and then 1 degree so the order of reactivity of alcohol towards halogen acid will be 3 degree alcohol is more reactive than 2 degree alcohol then 1 degree alcohol it means more reactive alcohol is 3 degree 2 degree and 1 degree on the basis of the stability of carbocation similarly the nucleophilicity of this halide ion greater will be the nucleophilicity of the halide ion greater will be the reactivity of this halide ion towards the carbocation so what is happening the order of reactivity of halide ion is i minus then Br minus then Cl minus. It means most nucleophilic halide ion is iodide ion. So if we take halogen acid SCl in the presence of primary and secondary alcohol, then this reaction is taking place in the presence of Lewis acid that is ZnCl2. This reaction is known as Groves process. So let's see how this reaction is taking place in the presence of so when we react this ethyl alcohol, this is 1 degree alcohol with the halogen acid, this reaction is taking place in the presence of ZnCl2 which is behaving as a Lewis acid. So this Lewis acid will help in breaking of this carbon oxygen bond. So there will be cleavage of carbon oxygen bond will be taking place and formation of CH3, CH2, Cl that is chloroethane and removal of H2O will take place. So what is happening in this case, how this reaction is taking place? In this case, ZnCl2 is behaving as a Lewis acid it means it is electron deficient so it will attract the electron of the lone pair so what is happening there will be formation of bond between oxygen and zinc that is ZnCl2 so because of that there will be positive charge coming on the oxygen and you know that in the case of oxygen positive charge is unstable so the shared pair of carbon oxygen bond will be shifted towards the oxygen so this lewis acid is helping in the cleavage of carbon oxygen bond 2 degree alcohol ch3 ch oh ch3 
HCl in the presence of ZnCl2 there will be formation of CH3 CH Cl CH3 so this is isopropyl chloride and removal of H2O is taking place so in the case of 3 degree the reaction will take place in moderate temperature and there is formation of tert butyl chloride and removal of H2O. So this, these first two reactions, which is in the case of one degree and two degree, this reaction is known as Groves process because in this case, there is use of Lewis acid that is ZnCl2. Whereas in the case of three degree, reaction will easily occur because the stability of carbocation of three degree is more stable. So this three degree alcohol will easily react with HCl. So there is no requirement of this Lewis acid. In the case of neopentyl alcohol, this is neopentyl alcohol. So if we do nucleophilic substitution reaction in this case, so what is happening in this case, there will be one to methyl shift will be taking place because we know that this nucleophilic substitution in the presence of halogen acid is proceed by the help of carbocation formation. And we know that the more stable carbocation is 3 degree degree then 2 degree then 1 degree. So what is happening in this case if we try to form neopentyl chloride then that will be not formed in the presence of halogen acid because of the formation of more stable carbocation. HCl will ionize to give H plus and Cl minus. So what is happening in this case? First of all, electrophile will attack on the lone pair of the oxygen. So there is a formation of CH3, 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 CH2, O, H, H. Positive charge will be coming on the oxygen and we know that oxygen is unstable when it is having positive charge. So the bond will be shifted towards this. So there will be formation of 1 degree carbocation and 1 degree carbocation is unstable. So 1 to methyl shift will be taking place. So there will be formation of tertiary carbocation. So tertiary carbocation will be formed which is more stable than 1 degree carbocation. So further chloride ion will attack on this tertiary carbocation. So there will be formation of CH3, C, CH3, CH2, CH3, Cl. So what is the name of this compound? 2 chloro 2 methyl butane. 2 chloro 2 methyl butane. So it means in the presence of HCl, this alcohol, this neopentyl alcohol will not give CH3. This is neopentyl chloride. So in the presence of HCl, this neopentyl alcohol will not give this neopentyl chloride because this reaction is taking place by the help of carbocation. So if there is a possibility of formation of more stable carbocation is there. So in this case, there is one to methyl shift is taking place. So it means we cannot prepare this neopentyl chloride by this nucleophilic substitute reaction. This is neopentane. So in the case of hydrocarbon, if we do free radical mechanism in the presence of chlorine, it means this reaction is taking place in the presence of light by the help of free radical mechanism. In the case of free radical mechanism, there is no 1 to methyl shift is taking place. So it means in this case, we can form this compound. So there will be formation of CH3 C, CH3, CH3, CH2. So this compound which is formed by the help of free radical mechanism is 1 degree halide because in this case there is no rearrangement is taking place because this reaction is not taking place by the carbocation formation whereas in the presence of this neopentyl alcohol there is a carbocation formation is taking place due to which in this case the final product which is obtained is a 3 degree halide whereas this is 1 degree halide.
नेक्स्ट हेलोजन एसिड इज एच पी आर एंड एच आई इन दिस केस द रिएक्शन इज नॉट डायरेक्टली टेकिंग प्लेस इन दिस केस इन सी टू रिएक्शन इज टेकिंग प्लेस इट मीन्स ड्यूरिंग द रिएक्शन देयर इज फॉर्मेशन ऑफ एच बी आर एंड एच आई इज टेकिंग प्लेस फर्दर दिस एच बी आर विच इज जनरेटेड ड्यूरिंग द रिएक्शन विल रिएक्ट विद पर्टिकुलर एल्कोहल सो लेट सी हाउ दिस रिएक्शन इज टेकिंग प्लेस इन द केस ऑफ एच बी आर वी टेक सी एच थ्री सी एच टू ओ एच एंड रिएक्ट इट विद एच बी आर इन द प्रेजेंस ऑफ लिटिल अमाउंट ऑफ कंसनट्रेटेड एच टू एस ओ फोर रिफ्लक्सिंग इज डन ड्यूरिंग दिस रिएक्शन रिफ्लक्सिंग इज डन सो देयर विल बी फॉर्मेशन ऑफ सी एच थ्री सी एच टू बी आर एंड रिमूवल ऑफ एच टू ओ इज टेकिंग प्लेस दिस रिएक्शन कैन नॉट अकर डायरेक्टली इन दिस केस द मिक्सर ऑफ सोल्यूशन विल बी टेकन इट मीन्स द मिक्सर ऑफ इथेनॉल इन विच एच बी आर विल बी फोर्टी सेवन परसेंट एंड लिटिल अमाउंट ऑफ कंसनट्रेटेड एच टू एस ओ फोर विल बी एडेड विच इज बिहेविंग एज अ कैटलिस्ट फॉर दिस रिएक्शन ड्यूरिंग दिस रिएक्शन दिस इज इन सी टू रिएक्शन ड्यूरिंग दिस रिएक्शन एच बी आर विल बी जनरेटेड एंड दिस एच बी आर विल फर्दर रिएक्ट विद द इथनॉल सो देयर विल बी फॉर्मेशन ऑफ दिस ब्रोमो इथेन विल बी टेकिंग प्लेस सो हाउ दिस रिएक्शन इज टेकिंग प्लेस सो इन दिस केस फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल के बी आर दैट इज पोटेशियम ब्रोमाइड ड्यूरिंग द रिएक्शन विल बी रिएक्टिंग विद एच टू एस ओ फोर कंसनट्रेटेड एच टू एस ओ फोर सो देयर इज अ फॉर्मेशन ऑफ के एच एस ओ फोर एंड एच बी आर सो दिस एच बी आर विच इज जनरेटेड ड्यूरिंग द रिएक्शन विल फर्दर रिएक्ट विद द इथेनॉल सो देयर विल बी फॉर्मेशन ऑफ दिस ब्रोमो इथेन विल बी टेकिंग प्लेस सिमिलरली इन द केस ऑफ एच आई ऑल्सो सो लेट सी इन द केस ऑफ एच आई वॉट इज हैपनिंग इफ वी रिएक्ट इथनॉल विद एच आई सो इन दिस केस ऑल्सो द मिक्सर ऑफ सोल्यूशन विल बी टेकिंग इट मीन्स रिफ्लक्सिंग विल बी डन सो इथनॉल मिक्सर ऑफ सोल्यूशन दैट इज इथनॉल फिफ्टी सेवन परसेंट ऑफ एच आई एंड कंसनट्रेटेड एच थ्री पी ओ फोर दैट इज फॉस्फोरिक एसिड विल बी टेकिन सो देयर इज फॉर्मेशन ऑफ सी एच थ्री सी एच टू आई दैट इज इथेन आयोडाइड एंड रिमूवल ऑफ एच टू ओ विल बी टेकिंग प्लेस सो इन दिस केस ऑल्सो दिस इज इन सी टू रिएक्शन दिस एच आई इज प्रोड्यूस ड्यूरिंग द रिएक्शन सो हाउ दिस इज प्रोड्यूस इन दिस रिएक्शन फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल के आई पोटेशियम आयोडाइड will be reacting with एच थ्री पी ओ फोर दैट इज फॉस्फोरक एसिड सो देयर विल बी फॉर्मेशन ऑफ के एच टू पी ओ फोर एंड रिमूवल ऑफ एच आई विल बी टेकिंग प्लेस फर्दर दिस एच आई विल बी रिएक्टिंग विद इथनॉल सो देयर विल बी फॉर्मेशन ऑफ दिस कंपाउंड दैट इज इथाइल आयोडाइड विल बी टेकिंग प्लेस सो वॉट इज रिफ्लक्सिंग रिफ्लक्सिंग इज द मिक्सर ऑफ सोल्यूशन दैट इज इथनॉल फोर्टी सेवन परसेंट एच बी आर विच इज कॉन्स्टेंट बॉइलिंग मिक्सर फर्दर इन विच देयर इज लिटिल अमाउंट ऑफ कंसनट्रेट एच टू एस ओ फोर इज एडेड दिस मिक्सर इज प्रेजेंट इन द फ्लास्क इट विल बी हीटेड टू देयर बॉइलिंग पॉइंट एंड देन दिस सोल्यूशन विल बी कन्वर्टेड इन टू वेपर विल अगेन कंडेंसड बिकॉज देयर इज अ कंडेंसर इज कनेक्टेड टू द फ्लास्क दैट वेपर विल बी अगेन ट्रांसफर टू द कोनिकल फ्लास्क बाय द हेल्प ऑफ कंडेंसर बाय कंडेंसिंग सो देयर विल बी constant boiling will be taking place this is known as refluxing so during this reaction this hbr cannot be directly react so by in c2 during the reaction hbr and hi will be produced which will react with the alcohol so there will be formation of particular alkyl halide will be taking place now we have studied the action of halogen acid on alcohol now next is phosphorus halide action of phosphorus halide on alcohol so let's see what is happening in the phosphorus halide there are two types of phosphorus halide one is phosphorus pentachloride second is phosphorus trihalide so in the case of these phosphorus halide the by product which will be obtained is different so let's see how the reaction is taking place in this case if we take alcohol and react it with pcl5 there will be formation of ch3 ch2 
CL and removal of it means the byproduct which will be obtained is POCl3 and HCl. This is the byproduct in the case of PCl5. Next, in the case of PCl3, in the case of PCL3, the byproduct which will be obtained is different. So in this case, CH3, CH2, Cl will be formed and the byproduct is H3PO3. This is phosphorus acid will be formed in this reaction. So there is a difference of byproduct when we react with PCL5 or PCL3. So in this case, you have to balance the reaction. In this case, there will be three moles of this ethyl alcohol will be taken in the presence of PCL3. So there will be formation of three moles of ethyl chloride and removal of H3PO3. So you have to remember what is the difference in the byproduct. In the case of bromine and iodine, phosphorus pentahalide of these halogen is not possible because they are very bulky. Their size is very larger because of that there will be no formation of pentahalides of this halogen. Whereas their tribromide and triiodide can be formed. It means there is a formation of phosphorus tribromide and triiodide is taking place. But in this case, in C2 reaction is taking place. Tribromide and triiodide are generated during the reaction because they are unstable. So what is happening in this case if we react CH3, CH2, OH with PBr3 so there will be formation of CH3, CH2, Br and H3 PO3 will be taking place. You have to balance the reaction because this is tribromide. So in this case, 3 moles of this alcohol and 3 moles of this alkyl bromide will be formed and the byproduct is a phosphorus acid. So in this case, this is in C2 reaction because during the reaction, this PBr3 is generated. So how it is generated? First of all, phosphorus that is P4 will be reacting with Br2, 6 mole of Br2 will be taken. So there will be formation of 4 moles of PBr3. Further, this PBr3 will be reacting with ethanol. So this is in C2 reaction because this tribromide is unstable. Similar reaction will be shown by phosphorus triiodide. Now next preparation method of alkyl halide by the action of thionyl chloride on alcohol. So let's see how the reaction is taking place. Formula of thionyl chloride is SO. Cl2. So in this case, CH3, CH2, OH, the presence of SOCl2. Reaction is taking place in the presence of pyridine. This is behaving as a base. It is a base. So there will be formation of CH3, CH2, Cl and removal of SO2 and SCL. This reaction method is more preferred in comparison to phosphorus pentahalides or trihalides because in the presence of SOCl2, reaction with SOCl2, there will be formation of byproduct which are gases. So these gaseous product will be easily removed from the product side due to which there will be pure formation of this chloroethane will be taking place. Because of that, this reaction method is more more preferred and more economical in comparison to phosphorus pentahalides or trihalides. 